Hey guys, and welcome back to the channel and to another reaction video. Today, watching season one, episode nine of House of the Dragon. And in last episode, Viserys died, which honestly, I'm really sad about because I do think he was a good person. Like he just really cared about his family. He loved Rhaenyra so much, way more than his other children. He loved Rhaenyra, was still defending her right to the very end, right to his very last breath. Unfortunately, he may or may not have given a message to Alison, which was meant for Rhaenyra, which has got lost in translation because they both have sons with the same name. Why is there only like two names in House of the Dragon, which people use over and over? I don't know, but it's gonna cause a lot of conflicts. So it's, it's not gonna look good because at the end of last episode, like, we saw Alison and Rhaenyra, you know, sort of come to a truce. It was a nice moment, to be honest. I have missed Rhaenyra and Alison being friends and just having each other's back in a way. And they both made a speech and it was like a lovely moment. It was a lovely dinner until it wasn't a lovely dinner when the pickle brought up. Um, but yeah, it was a nice moment and it was so lovely to see. But then Viserys, in his delusion as he was dying, fucked that all up. So <laughs> Alison now believes that... Rhaenyra is not the rightful heir to the throne and that her son is instead he is the prince who was promised except he's not because he is a massive asshole like rapist asshole um so I don't know why she thinks that son would be named prince but whatever um <laughs> let's start watching I actually this episode is all about team green as far as I'm aware and then the final episode is all about team black feels so eerie and quiet and dark Oh, is that a rumor being spread? <laughs> oh. Oh. I actually feel bad for her because she did really care for Viserys for a long time. I have made Intalia. Some of the servants. Are they going to keep it quiet, do you think? Try and get things in place before they tell Rhaenyra. They can undermine her. He told me he wished for Egon to be king. There's a lie! Not that Egon! That Egon's a dickhead! And he was fucking delusional! You can't take the words of a delusional man! He's dying! Like... <laughs> okay, but no one else was there to hear it, so... So you should just accept that... that that's that, and no one's gonna believe you? <laughs> because he wasn't even talking about your son? Oh, man. If... Why couldn't Rhaenyra just name her child something else? We wouldn't be in this situation. Wait, why is she like candles? She's doing it shadily as well, looking behind her. I'm guessing that must mean something. Maybe she's signaling to someone somewhere. With his last breath, he impressed upon the queen his final wish that his son, Aegon, should succeed him. It's so delusional, man. Like, if he honestly believed that, why would he have defended Rhaenyra for so many years and then change his mind at the last second? There was no need to sully you with darkling schemes. I will not have this. Yeah. To hear that you are plotting. Defend him. To replace the fealty to the princess. That was mm -hmm. 20 years ago. Most of them now do. The king changed his mind. No, we didn't. No, we did Oh, this is so infuriating. The boy's mother is a witness. This is seizure. This is theft. Yes. You know, I've never cared for this guy before. But I'm liking him now. <laughs> I care not. I will have no Sit part. Down. <gasps> I hate Kristen Cole, man. He is the so He's the worst. He actually sucks. Cast down your sword. I will not Who the fuck does he the queen. think he no, is? No, Get him out of here. He sucks. He just killed an old man. And no one's like bat batting an eyelid. No one? <laughs> Apart from him? The door remains shut until we finish our business. R.I.P. Lord Beesbury, Jesus Christ. He was just defending what Viserys actually wanted and Sir Kristen God just fucking killed him. Like, that's so effed up. The former heir cannot, of course, be allowed to remain the free former heir. and draw support to her claim. She will never bend the knee. Nor will Damon, which you know. Why would they? They're the rightful heirs! Mm. <laughs> this is making me angry. It is unsavory, yes. What unsavory, Otto, is you being alive? Succession, and then there is Damon to consider. You can tell he's uneasy about this. 
He loved her. I will not have you deny this. Thank you, Alison. One more word and I will have you. Respect for her here. Because these guys are fucking crazy. What do you suggest, Your Grace? And the fact that they plan this all without Alison as well just shows how power hungry they all are. They didn't even care about her opinion. Respect. And until there is one, I have no place here. Look at Otto trying to freaking order everyone around. See, Sir Chris and Cole, that's what honor looks like. <laughs> not here. He's not in his rooms. Leave the poor girl alone. He's better off not being near that butthead. There is a beast beneath the boards. Oh, my dearest love. A beast beneath the boards? What does that mean? I know she tells prophecies, but I have no idea what the fuck that means. Gone into the city. Find him. The music is making this like really intense. Bring him to me and me alone, Sir Eric. Oh God. <gasps> they locked her in her room. They locked her in her room. At that point, I'd rip out all the curtains, tie them together, freaking haul my ass out of that window. <laughs> what are they doing? Are they putting everyone in prison? God, God. Oh, and this guy as well. <laughs> <laughs> oh god Hagar must be found and he must be brought to isn't peace. it crazy that he's only loyal to her because Very... Rhaenyra didn't want to leave her life for him he has some glorious hair maybe that's wrong about that woman like encounters in the window then it's, it felt like it, w it was symbolizing something though of importance how you've grown these guys have history? Do you think? It feels like they have history. From the looks and the words they exchanged. Weak! Weak! I will not bend the knee. Who the fuck does Otto think he is? Oh, this is winding me up. I dislike Otto so much. <laughs> I even quite like Alison, you know? Like, I don't I hate Alison, but our dad is the worst. He's, House fell. he's always been so power Keeps hungry. He's sworn oath to the princess. Queen. Very well. He's gonna kill her, though. They look so terrified. I don't blame them, to be honest. He's literally getting them to bend the knee, mostly out of fear. I mean, some of them obviously never believed in Rhaenyra being the queen. Oh, and this guy. <laughs> this episode is making me angry. <laughs> On a ship to Yeti, he could be dead. If only. <laughs> they would really solve this situation out. <laughs> what the fuck is this? They're making kids fight? What the fuck? This is so oh, fucked up. Do you see now what he is? Yeah, he's an absolute dickhead. He cannot be the king. Hey, God. One of many I'd wager. Oh man, he's gonna have so many bastards as well. Do you think he swore to the king and now he's gonna like be the whistleblower? Oh no, is he gonna get caught before they open the gate for him? He's unfit to rule. Oh my heart's he racing for him! You'll find no buyers for your words here. She has information! Oh, oh, the gate! No! Where were you going then with such urgency? It wasn't urgent. Just a nice stroll. <laughs> I don't know who I dislike more out of those two, to be honest. I do feel bad for Alison because it's not her fault that Viserys told her the wrong name. <laughs> oh, I'm not even the wrong name, but like she, he told the wrong person. And that's what's so frustrating about this is that he told the wrong person and there just happens to be two, a son and a grandson with the same name. And you are usurping the throne. It was my husband's dying wish. <sighs> believe it or no, <laughs> it is of no cost. Oh, no one's gonna believe that though. He loves Rhaenyra so much. So, 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 so much. And anyone could see that. Gone these six long years to fight a desperate battle. 
returning grievously, if not more. Don't listen to her. Leave the word of my house is not fickle. Thank you. <gasps> Thank you. No. You should have been queen. But it's too late for that now, isn't it? That's from you. The Iron Throne was yours by blood and by temperament. But those words mean shit, because they're not going to do shit. Away from violence and sure destruction and instead toward peace. Yeah, good luck guiding your awful son to peace. And yet you toil still in service to men. Your father, your husband, yep. your son. Have you never imagined yourself on the Iron Throne? I don't even think she'd be bad on the Iron Throne, to be honest. She's basically ran it since Viserys was too ill to. Is she going to keep her locked in this room then until she basically bends the knee? Or they're going to kill her if she doesn't? Or are you simply a further peel in this stinking onion? Who's that Damon's ex? He's like, shit, people know. In case they come looking for him. Where's the prince? He is safely tucked away. I can literally feel the desperation reeking off Otto right now. I look into it. Well, that's not much of a promise, is it? I'll look into it. Is that worth agreeing to? Where is he? Is he under there? What the fuck is he doing yeah. under there? We'll meet him outside the city walls. Run! <laughs> He's like, fuck that! <laughs> I don't want to talk to Otto. Fuck this shit. <laughs> At this point, I'll just let him go, to be honest. See, see what happens. <laughs> oh, it's Aemond. Wait, they're going to kill him? Oh, what is happening? Aemond's like, this is my throne, bitch. <laughs> you don't deserve it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's right. I mean, I'm pretty sure Chris and God's going to come out of this on skate. But nice to see if you get pushed down the stairs. <laughs> Why is he laughing? They're going to make you king. Oh, this is a massive spectacle right now. He's, he's up there, like up the stairs. He's walking away. <laughs> you should just let him sail away. To be honest, I think that would have been. The good thing for everyone if Egon just disappeared. <laughs> I know I'd much rather see Aemond as king than Egon. Of the family that we both desire. Or whatever our differences are. You know, Otto really just desires power. <laughs> good of the family, my ass. I have Egon. We'll proceed now as I see fit. I do respect her taking the reins here, though. Otto has just been using her like a freaking puppet. Or you, his daughter's childhood companion. No, her dad would also not want her to be murdered, Otto. <laughs> Kristen Cole will be named Lord Commander of the King's Ugh, Guard. Really? There's so many better candidates than Kristen Cole. You look so much like your mother in certain lights. Why is he changing the subject? Yeah, literally, roll your eyes. Leave. Your Grace. So like, fuck's sake, I just want to drink in peace. Late, Lord Along its threads travels news of all our doings. She has to get her feet out to get information? Is this guy got a foot fetish? Feed the weaver. What the fuck? And this weaver watches me. This is so random. He does have a foot fetish and he's fucking... Oh, he's using information to get to show him her feet. What the fuck? Oh, I hate him even more. It's your lady in waiting. This is stressing me out. Tell you. <laughs> you know, I'm more like fly without purpose. <laughs> Begging your pardon for good. Just watching him look at her feet makes me like. Urgh. Oh no! Stop it! I was really enjoying this show until this point. <laughs> Poor Alison. She had to fucking just get her feet out for some guy to touch himself over them for information. This is so wrong. This is so wrong. If I was her, I would have Clubfoot fucking executed. Absolutely executed at this point. <laughs> I don't give a fuck about information. He must die for trying to freaking blackmail her. 
If you don't get your feet out, I'm not going to give you information. Nah, dead. Dead. Gone. Bye. <gasps> Who's here? Is someone come to save her? I can not let this treachery stand. <gasps> Finally! Someone's got some balls to do something. Uh, please escape. Don't. Don't. Wait, what? Who's that? <gasps> it was the guy who tried to tell Rhaenyra. I hope they get out okay. Do not delay and look at shit. Get going. Oh, is it the secret passageway that Rhaenyra used to use when she was a kid? I can't tell. The black water's this way. Come on. Did they kill the white worm? No, come. Oh, I feel really bad for, for her. 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 Having to leave Before her dragon. You know Can we not just like telepathically tell the dragon fly away? <laughs> Oh man, are they even going to make it out? I don't know if they are. Oh, I'm scared for both of them! Shit, you've been separated from him. He is so dumb of this shit. He does not want to be king whatsoever. He's like, I don't want to fucking want this day. He changed his mind. Wow. Well, at least he knows. That's right. He does not believe a single word that's coming out of her mouth. That wasn't meant for you! The incarnousness, for all her faults, she is your sister. This is falling on your deaf ears. Daughter. You love me. <laughs> no, she doesn't. You're a fucking a horrible human being. Man, she's so lost now. How the fuck is she going to get out of here? Should succeed him! Boo! Boo! <laughs> there are no cheers from the crowd. Oh, oh, I put that back. There's a, there's a smattering of clapping. This is all that Otto has wanted for so long. I'm still sad that Viserys brought him back as Hand of the King. That was just such a wrong move by him. I miss Viserys as King! <laughs> There's no one questioning, you know, the death of the other guy that was on the council randomly. Just happened to die the same night King Viserys died. There's no one questioning this. May What's she going to do? Just make her escape. His need. I hope she gets her dragon back. This episode's been so stressful for me. <laughs> Great acting, though, by everyone. Everyone's like, oh, fuck. I really don't want to be king, but I have no choice. <laughs> He's in too deep now. And he was like, that should be me. <laughs> Is the true heir to the Iron Throne. Oh, shut the fuck up, Sir Kristen Cole. God. Get over it. Rhaenyra didn't want you. Get over yourself. Your dick game not that good. <sighs> Sorry, she needs to get out of my system. <laughs> Just Aemond. What about? Ever so slight nod. Lord of the Seven Feels so wrong. And protector of the realm. Egg on the king! No one gives a fuck. <laughs> now they're cheering after some, you know, encouragement. Look at Otto's face. He is so fucking happy right now. He just doesn't have king vibes, you know. I don't think he's going to be king for long. What the fuck? Is this Rainus? It is. Is this Rainus? Dracarys! <laughs> Dracarys on their asses! Not the people, but you know, everyone up front. Is it? Is it? Is it? Is it? Is it? Let's fucking go! She looks sick! Let's fucking go, Rainus! Kick their asses! They're closing the doors? Well, Aegon's first day as king has been a mess. Dracarys. She's so cool. Look at that armor. Wow. I love her. If you're going to do it, now is the time. They're defenseless. <laughs> say, say, say. The dragon is so cool as well. Look at all those spikes. Man, she could have ended the war there and then. We're just fucking burning the shit out of all of them. I think that was her declaration of war, though. That was such a 
a good ending. Oh my god. I love Raina so much. Ah, what a queen, boss ass bitch. Although I still think she just killed them all there and then with the Karis, and then that would have been that. Then go over to Rhaenyra to like, you know what? It's all clear now. Fucking kill them all. Bish bash bosh. Burn to a crisp. Take the Iron Throne. It's rightfully yours. Let's marry our children. The end. But she flew away. I, don't, I guess, I don't know. She didn't want to kill them. I, get, I think she respects Alicent too much to kill them. But she fucking should have because I would save a whole war. And yeah, I'm just very excited for next episode because I think next episode is all going to be about Rhaenyra and Daemon. And I miss them so much this episode. Like it was really cool to see more about what was going on with Alison and, you know, all of her side. But goddamn, did I miss Rhaenyra and Daemon so much. Like they have such an impact on the show. I do feel really bad for Alison. Like she's just doing what she thinks is right. So I can't really fault her because she does really believe that Viserys' final wish was for Aegon to be the next king. But he he did not mean that Aegon. That, that Aegon's bad. He is not king material. I felt so bad for her when it came to getting her fucking feet out to get information. Like what the fuck? We need to get rid of that guy. Like we need to get rid of so many of these men. Like so Kristen Cole in the bin. Whatever that guy's name is, Clubfoot, Sir, Sir Laris, in the bin, Otto in the bin. Like, they. Like, I respect Kristen for being so protective over Allison, because, like, you know, that is his job. But man needs to. He needs to be checked. Like, he needs to fucking calm down. Otto, I'm glad Allison has realized that, you know, Otto has been using her as basically a pawn in his own game of chess. And, you know, he, he is the reason why she's in this situation. But yeah, I, Sir Laris needs to fucking go. Like, ew, like, what the fuck? Like, she's queen. She should be doing that for information. You should be giving her information willingly. If, oh, yeah. He needs to go. And I hope Alison is the one who fucking kills him. <laughs> but overall, really good episode. Really stressed me out. Really stressed me out because obviously I want Rhaenyra to be on the throne. And, you know, I like Alison. I think Alison is a good character, but it's just that everyone who is around her fucking sucks. <laughs> they suck so bad. But overall, a really good episode. I really enjoyed it. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Remember as well to be kind to each other. It's just a show meant for entertainment, you know, so please don't be at each other's throats because at the end of the day, it's really not that deep. It's a show. Um, but yeah, thank you for watching. If you did enjoy, please remember to smash that like button. If you haven't already, hit the subscribe notification bell. And as always, the full reactions are on Patreon. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.